Hello friends, welcome to the DJ Voice channel. You all have come here with the latest and important update, so the friend will watch the video till the end. And if you are new to the channel, then you must subscribe to the channel. You will subscribe and click on the bell option given along with it to turn it on. Read about the latest update. The Rwanda deportation scheme will not begin until the summer, Rishi Sunak admitted on Monday acknowledging a further delay to the policy even as MPS and peers began debating it for the final time. The Prime Minister told a press conference that the first flights taking asylum seekers to Kigali would not take off for another 10 to 12 weeks, despite having promised they would do so in the spring. Sunak announced his revised timetable hours before MPS began what he insisted would be a final day of debates on the Rwanda bill, with members in the Commons and the Lords braced for a long night of debate. Enough is enough, Sunak said. No more prevarication, no more delay. Parliament will sit there tonight and vote no matter how late it goes, no ifs, no buts, starting from the moment that the bill passes. We will begin the process of removing those identified for the first flight. We have prepared for this moment. Sunak has put the Rwanda scheme at the centre of his promise to stop people crossing the channel in small boats, despite warnings that even the threat of deportation would not deter desperate people from attempting to do so. He said on Monday that his policy would only be considered a success if the crossing stopped entirely. Success is when the boats have been stopped, he said. That's what the country expects. With the Conservatives more than 20 points behind in the polls, some on the Tory benches are hoping the successful start of the Rwanda scheme will provide an electoral boost and shift the focus on two Labour's migration policies. Sunak on Monday sought to blame the Labour Party for the numerous delays to the start of the scheme, even though the government had the parliamentary time to push it through earlier. If Labour peers had not spent weeks holding up the bill in the House of Lords to try to block these flights altogether, we would have begun this process weeks ago, he said. So friend, this was some latest and important update, which was very important to share with you guys. Hope you like our latest update today. See you in next update. Till then give us permission. Thanks for watching.